Hi everyone, another nice question here. We want to find out the area of this circle. Yes, so we have a circle with four identical squares. Uh, each has an area of 16 square centimeters. The vertical sides are all parallel. The square on the right has two vertices that touch the circumference of the circle, and the bottom left vertex of the bottom left square also touches the circumference of the circle. So we want to find the area of the circle, and for that we need the radius. So let's start by finding the length of each side of the square. We can do that by taking the square root of 16, which is four centimeters. We can construct this radial line, which is the perpendicular bisector of the chord, meaning that we can find the midpoint of the vertical sides of the squares. Uh, let's construct this white line segment as well, which is also another chord of the circle. And we can construct another radial line, which is also a perpendicular bisector of that chord. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's have a look at this right triangle, which is made up of a horizontal edge of the square, four centimeters, half of the vertical length, two centimeters, and a quarter of the previous chord that we've just seen. So we can work out the hypotenuse using Pythagoras, where A is four and B is two. Uh, so what we are left with is C squared is equal to 20, and therefore C is then the square root of 20. And this can be simplified to two square root five. Now let's label this length x, and we want to now try find out this value. Okay, to do this, we can first consider this angle, which we're going to label with the red dot. We can construct this right triangle, and we can also construct this right triangle. Okay, now both of these triangles have a right angle and share a common red angle. This means that the remaining angle must be the same. And they are similar triangles. And we can go ahead and label this last angle with a yellow dot. Okay, now, because these triangles are similar, we can work out the length of x by setting up this ratio problem, where x over 2 is equal to 2 square root 5 over 4. We multiply both sides by 2, and we get x is equal to 4 square root 5 over 4. 4 divided by 4 is 1, so x has a value of square root 5. All right here we can double the length of half of the white chord, which is 4 square root 5. And we now have another right angle triangle where the radius is the hypotenuse, and we can use Pythagoras again to solve for r. The radius is equal to square root 5 squared plus 4 square root 5 squared. And this simplifies to 5 plus 80, which is 85. So to get the radius, take the square root of both sides. So the radius is square root of 85. And now that we have the radius, we can go ahead and work out the area of the circle, which is pi r squared. So that becomes pi times 85, which is 267.04 centimeters squared. And that's the two decimal points. That is a nice question.